Hey, what is up guys? Welcome to RAM Overload and today I'm going to show you guys how to clear up your disk and find hidden files that are taking up space. So you guys can see on my computer I have 15 gigabytes free only out of 237 and I don't even know what I have on my computer. So the easiest way to find out what you have on your computer and whatever some hidden files you have that are taking up a lot of space is to download this tool called Tree Sites and it's completely free. They have a paid one also, but the free one is perfectly good and you know, it's it's amazing. It does whatever you need it to do. So go ahead and download that. I already have it downloaded, so I won't be doing that, but let me open it up. So the cool thing about this application is that it will work on any hard drive. So whether it's your internal hard drive or if you want to use it on an external hard drive or a USB or anything, uh, it'll work on all that. So first what you want to do is select your directory. So I'm going to just check my whole C drive uh, because that's basically what my computer is. This Toshiba is an external hard drive, which um, I, don't, I don't really care about that one, but it's mainly this internal one. So you want to just select it and then select folder and give it a couple seconds to basically uh, you know, just run through the whole hard drive and try to find what it's trying to find. So right off the bat, we see that my users folder is taking up 113 gigabytes. My windows is 34 gigabytes and this random six files is 26 gigabytes. We'll check it out in a minute. Um, and then just, you know, other random stuff, program files, program data, recycle bin. So um, let's, before we get into that, let's just dig down into each one. So you can see then my, in my users is that, and then desktops, I have that. And then I have a videos folder, which, um, what is this? Just some uh, courses that I was doing on my free time. So you can see that's the 19 gigs on my desktop and then there's another eight gig for like development that I was doing programming so you know my users folder seems fine um, just with stuff I need Windows you don't really want to touch your stuff in your Windows folder because um, that's just Windows stuff and then this weird 26 gigabytes what's this so this is a hibernation file and then also a page file so these files are created or generated when your computer goes to sleep and if you have a lot of stuff open um, you know it has to store those files somewhere so or it has to store those information somewhere so when you uh, when the computer wakes up again it's able to open up all those uh, programs and everything you had opened already so that's 19 gigs uh, I, don't, I, I guess I have a lot of stuff on my personal computer, which is why it's pretty big. But yeah, um, and then recycle bin. I don't even know why that's that big, but basically um, this gives you a good rundown as to why or what is taking up space on your computer. Okay, um, and then from there, you know, obviously you can go to that location like my recycle bin and then just clear it out from there. Uh, these page files and hibernation files, there's other methods to clear those out because you can't just go directly to them to delete it. Um, there, there's other ways you have you would have to do that. But yeah, that's pretty much it. You know, um, it, it gives a clear breakdown of what is being used where. And yeah, I think it's pretty neat. Let me know what you guys think in the comments below. You know, if you like this video, if you like um, this tool or not, or if you have another suggestion, I'd definitely love to check it out. Other than that, you know, if you like this video, give it a, give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe and I will see you guys next time. Peace.